This is the last week of school for my students as they are secondary 4 and will be graduating. In another week's time, it will be my last day of school as well. It has been a long and tiring process leading up to this, but I will say that it was all worth it and it was the best way to conclude this chapter of my life. The first part would be my students' graduation. As usual, it was pretty difficult to get footages in class, so here's me enjoying my breakfast from Coffee Bean during my admin time. After school, we set up the graduation backdrop in the hall. Yes, my colleagues were totally judging me for doing this, but since we are done, I can afford to play a little, right? Moments like this, being tall is so helpful. And after a few hours, and with teamwork, we are finally done with the decoration! Sadly, the next morning when we came back to school, everything fell apart. So we had to quickly put everything back into place before the students arrive. And I also prepared some handwritten cards for my students, since it will be the last day I'm seeing them. After school, I went to buy some snacks for their graduation party the next day. It was the day of their class graduation party. More decorations to be set up and I decorated the classrooms with my students. Everything feels a little weird today since it will be the last time for everything. Last time stepping into this classroom, last time sitting on this chair, last time hearing their greetings. Also, can I just say that I was deathly afraid of the balloon while trying to do some balloon sculpturing. So they played some games and I was the MC for the next activity, so I went to do my thing. Good morning teachers and students. Welcome to the prize presentation for the vocational week and the lucky draw segment. My name is Miss Kwa and I'll be your MC for today. I hope all of you had a brilliant time just now during the class games. Back to class for their supposed banquet-style graduation lunch, which sadly has downgraded to a western bento set in the classroom thanks to COVID restrictions, as usual. The last activity for the day was writing notes for their classmates and again, the last time they would be writing notes to each other and wishing them well. So they had another formal virtual graduation ceremony. Again, this was supposed to be live in the hall with everyone going up to the stage to collect their graduation certificate. But look what COVID has done. Anyway, I have been editing tons of video for this event and I'm going to show you guys a snippet of it. So I think energy is very contagious. So when they are very hyper, I go into the class, it puts me in a very good mood. So I like that they are very, very appreciative of their friends and teachers. They always say, like, oh, thank you, Miss Kwa. Thank you so this was a video done by the teachers for the students. Really, really and not one, but a few of my colleagues were telling me how iconic I was with the Pikachu. But not this. Me. Oh, okay. Okay. Why? Memorable. Yeah. Oh. Yes, that's right. Yeah, I need to remember the Pikachu. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always memorable. I'm going to go with the A. Yeah. Okay, any
Happy graduation! The graduation ceremony has come to an end. It was a bittersweet week because it was now my turn to be graduating. <laughs> wow! Oh, thank you. For your vlog. <laughs> feeling all the love from my students and my colleagues. I'm feeling extremely thankful to be put in this very sacred position as a teacher, to be impacting lives and making the slightest difference in their lives. Being in the position to give, at the same time receiving and learning so much more from them. I remember the very first time I wanted to join this service was because I felt that there was so much judgement and a lack of understanding towards people with special needs and I wanted to be a voice for them. And now I'm very proud of how much I've grown as a teacher and as a person in this journey. Ending things on a lighter note, we had a mini party with some of my colleagues. We ordered Shake Shack, played Mario Kart, and I forced them to play Just Dance with me since it was my last day. No! Last but not least, I want to say I'm super proud of all my students, my form class, my partner class, and my CCA students. I will miss you guys. Yeah.